Hi guys, it's me Camilla Hashi and welcome back to my channel. So hi guys, yeah, it's actually me. So, oh, people are joining. So there might be some other people. Today I'm showcasing Bonnie Bennett on game called The Vampire Origins. So yeah, uh, there will be some just some points I want to make about uh, the whole thing in this game. Uh, compare I want to compare Bonnie to other characters, other King Pass witches, uh, and just show you basic spells, basic things about her. So yeah. So starting with discussing this whole thing, uh, I bought Bonnie a few days ago. To be honest, so I might not know all the things about her but just know the main things and I'm just already compared her to some other checklists. So at first I was thinking sh who should I buy? Bonnie or maybe I should buy Ketsia. I was really a fan of Ketsia. Uh, I would just right now just say if you really want to be a team player, uh, a really a nice player, you should definitely get Ketsia. Because Ketsia has this power of resurrection and she doesn't resurrect a person as Bonnie or in a doo doo. Uh, it's more like she lifts the veil, uh, and all the people, all the dead people on the other side, they come back to life, which is absolutely insane and amazing, I would say. And I still like this thing, but whatever. Uh, also, I would just say Ketsia has more health, even though less magic, and Ketsia can revive herself, but still, I don't know which one I would actually choose, Bonnie or Ketsia, right now, even now. I would say, also comparing to other characters such as Inadu, who costs around 2000 Robux, Bonnie costs 1500 Robux, for example. Uh, I would just say, Bonnie is in the middle, in the golden middle, uh, because Inadu is always taken, whereas Bonnie is really easy to find, just my experience. Uh, it takes around 3 servers to find Bonnie. It could be a first time join, it can be a third time join, or for the first time join. It all depends on the time also. So let's start with the basic spells, I mean basic powers, keybind powers, we're starting with the keybinds today. Uh, the first thing, also there will be another video where I will showcase all the coins characters. Uh, there are four of them, Silas, Savina, Esther and Nora, I will showcase them too. So let's start with the keybinds, basic keybinds. When you press C you can say this spell, it's called Echaeus uh, or Ictus, just basic telekinetic fling. When you press C, you can do this. There is also, of course, a cooldown, which is 20 seconds, I guess. Uh, a lot of things you can find in spellbook. But also, information is really important too, because there are all the powers. So, next power is H. You hold H. And, you know, you paint the person. There's also a cooldown. And the last power, which is great and unique, I would say, L is projectile, which basically some random power to attack your enemy, which is actually really hard. Uh, I would call it a power which is hard to control because sometimes it's actually hard to control, especially on the swamp. Sometimes it's just, I don't know, a glitch or just a thing that it just sends to the person. Oh, eyes. You see, the wake snatched. Period. Period. So, whatever. Moving on, also as a game pass witch, she has this U, when you press U, it's a witch snap. Basically it snaps, for Bonnie it snaps all the immortal beings, for maybe Dahlia, I don't know about her, but for Dark Josie, I'm sure that she can snap regular witches too. Bonnie can't, that's the main thing I'm showcasing Bonnie today, not telling you all the other chapters. So yes, this is the basic one. Going on, there are some other powers of Bonnie which are really unique. Uh, starting with the F, it's telekinesis. You just press F on the person, just hold, do whatever you want with the person, send them straight to jail, I don't know, whatever. I like doing this, like holding them or something. So also there's a, like, I would just say, a really long cooldown, but okay, let's just ignore it, I guess. Just, it's around a minute, which is, I think, maybe way too long, but my opinion. Yes, next then, uh, really bonny thing is 
I would just call it internal snapping. I mean bone breaking because it just you can do it almost like there's two seconds cooldown first of all and you can do it almost like internal. Just finally there is just after three snaps there is a spine snack or something but she can do it like this. You see? You see, like, li it literally do something. So, yeah, you see, it's really a cool power, and I really like it. It's something compared to Katia's blood boiling power, so, yeah. Next, came bite power. Let me just check. Yes, just let's do premonition. So, you can press M. I was watching one showcase before buying them all, like buying Bonnie. Uh, and thinking maybe about kids here. Person said that you could just put your mouse on someone and just have a permission of them. It doesn't work like that. It's just a regular, unique, and how to say it? I forgot the words. Just, you can't control it. You have a permission spontaneously. You don't know who you will have permission of. So that's basically it. When I have low health, even though I just say I don't really love this power because I just think it's a little bit. It could be better. Uh, this healing works good, it works, but for example, I think Dark Joyce's healing works faster and it works like maybe the whole healing thing, which Bonnie is just maybe less. They're just not the full healing. And the last power which Bonnie has, uh, which I hope I don't forget anything. Yes. It's why? It's Bonnie's scream. It just basically this Enza scream, uh, like when Enza died, she screamed and made this shockwave. Well, here it works as literally a shockwave and everybody get flings, flinked, flung, whatever. So moving on to her spells. Basic spell is Phasmatos instead. She has really a lot of spells connected with Phasmatos. Just this, Incendia. So yeah, really cool spell. Just put them all on fire, so you can help them. Okay, so probably I just don't want to sh like maybe just hope can't do it. When someone tries to snap you, there is a sound like "I'm embarrassed for you." Also, when someone drinks you, there is this basic thing that Bonnie did once on Hilaire. I'm embarrassed for you. This one that like maybe blood choking, you know. You see what it is. Let me just show you one thing why everybody would want to. <coughs> this spell Phasmatos with Nectar is a spell to channel. So, this is the reason why everyone would want to channel you. So, channeling thing happening. And now you can see Phasmatos Animus Implant. Or whatever. And you have every magic, you have spirits, you have expression, and the magic goes up. Of course, there is this cooldown. In this book, there's everything written about every spell, every cooldown. I guess you can see this. Yes, 20 second cooldown. Where is it? Let me show you it. Um, yes, there's 3 minutes cooldown, which is long, but when you play, it might not be that noticeable. Her next spell. Oh, Convertus as. Converses. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, basically, it's a spell to turn someone into a stone. The spell is the same for Katia. It's literally the same. Yes, shush. So, yeah, just a stone thing. Uh, it just... For other witches, I think it hurts them. For help, it doesn't do anything. It takes a long time. And you can escape freely, like literally just run away. And... Probably the person it will be hard to find. Well, I mean, you know what I mean. Gosh, let's move on. Well, I don't want to show you Delphan Erencore. This is one of the basic spells. Why would I show you it? This spell. So, this spell is, mm, I would just call it Davina's spell because Davina has a power of it. 
it just rises every witch, everything, not only witch, everyone, and just flints them. Something may be close to Ketsia's Ashalana. This one is a hellfire, so basically I can show you it because witches deflect this spell, I mean, most witches at least, uh, you, but using the spell you can actually like kill an immortal being. You, you see what happens, it's just an automatic thing. Uh, heretics, maybe Lizzie and Josie siphon the spell, I don't know, maybe they do, I just have never tasted it. Uh, as you see, in out of fling the spell doesn't work on hope, but if there's, if there's any original, created like or even existing you can just use the spell and they will die believe it or not they will or i think even cybel as i heard she can die from it too well basically it's a hellfire which can kill any supernatural being which is funny okay going on uh this spell is dump i'm not going to show you it's just simple spell for every which it just creates a daylight ring this spell. Okay, let's do this spell and then this spell. Okay, there's a spell to stop someone's heart. Phasmatos, Sanguil, blah blah blah. So, let's do it on hope. You can get distracted if someone pushes you, this spell will stop. But I usually love doing like those things. So, this spell, Phasmatos, Sanguil, blah 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 blah, is a spell that, show that just stops someone's heart. Basically, it kills any witch, but you still can get distracted and like the spell will stop. But it works with Delphinite and Core. Even though the spell just have the heart, it is longer than Delphinite and Core. Okay, Phasmatos Reverus on Animum is a spell to revive someone. Person has to be on the other side. There is a glitch. As you see, magic. Not that ma not that much magic is spent, but her health like goes down. What else to say about the spell? Uh, there's a glitch when someone is on the other side, but it says that they are not on the other side. So, Phasmatus Tribum not Six Fairs are basically a basic spell. There are two spells. Bunny has two of them. Papilla Lux is a spell to find a witch too. Uh, I mean, a person at all. A player. And she has this unique spell, Phasmatus Tribum not Six Fairs. Well, you're so well, hi well hidden, girl. Well, basically, you just say the spell, you say the name of the player you want to find, and there is this fire road you like follow, uh, it leads you to the person. It might get glitched because there are hills. Bonnie has expression and one of those best spells, as I would say, spells to show how aesthetic she is. There is a spell, sort of, Haba, Harba, it's like pain infliction, but it's much like works much better. Let me just kill her. Well, you know, I'm just using both like H2. There's also Vadis, which is one of the basic spells too, because Silas has it, Davina has it, a lot of people has it. Let me show you the outfits. <clears throat> her second outfit is this outfit, which is I would say 80s party outfit. I guess it is this, but it's just a little bit reworked and it's a little bit different. I want to show you that I'm higher. And the last <clears throat> outfit Bonnie has is this Caroline and Stefan's bed in day, whatever. Just I have I every know. magic. I have but the spirit. Personally, I don't like I this outfit expression. because, well, you know, it's glitchy a little bit. You know, you see, you can't be incendiary. So yes, thank you guys, the person Zol, I would call you Zol because you have like numerous accounts. So thank you Zol, thank you forever, forever, three hours, Inadu, Inadu, hi, so bye. Thank you all, all the watchers for being here with me today. I hope it was useful. I hope I just made some, like, I cleared some things for you. Um, so yeah, see you later and bye. Incendia.